asked for pretty stupid. All right, first we have this box arrived and the brand is Traver, very nice. So we're gonna turn it around and we're gonna open the box right here. All right, and it's quite easy to open. Oh, we have some uh, stuff inside. Let's take out the black bag here. Oh, we have this uh, little tool. It is an L-shaped tool. It will be useful in the, to put the light thing together. All right, we have this uh, instruction here. Let's take out the box. Oh, we found a paper. This is a gift for you. Very nice. All right. We have this white box. So we have this tripod here. Very nice. It is looking kind of funny, but I'm sure it will be useful later on. So let's put it down right now. Next, we have more things in the back. We have this tool here. And we have this uh, power cord. Power supply. Now we have some uh, dry package. All right, when we open it, this is the lights. So here are the LED lights inside. And that is the power cord. And we have this uh, white piece of filter that we put on top of the LED. And we have this controller right here. And finally, we have this shape item that would go around the light. So at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine which is the, the gift from the seller and the instruction. Oh, and we have this black bag. We can put things together and go travel. All right, it is time to put the things together. First, we're gonna start off with the tripod. We're gonna open it up and we're gonna open it all the way to the other side and we're gonna make it stand. Oh, it sounds a little weird. It looks like the the bottom side is actually uh, uh, moving. And here we, I'm trying to tighten it even more. But interestingly, the bottom is still opens up like this. So I guess that is the way. I try reading the instruction and uh, try to fix it a little tighter trying to see if there's some sort of mechanic to make it like stand properly like how other tripods should be and looks like it'll just stay like this all right anyways so now we're gonna work on the light so there are three pieces for the light all right first we're gonna put the side of the light down and we're gonna put the filter on first. We're gonna make sure the four corners are nicely put on. And we're gonna flip around. And we have the LED lights uh, facing inward. And that's it. That is how it looks like. That is the light. All right? We have this uh, four blade thingy. So we're going to open it like this. So each one will be going on to each corner for on the back of the light. It looks a little tricky, but this is how it looks like afterward. It's quite stable. You can see here. All right, now we're going to use this uh, L-shape uh, junction. So we're gonna loosen it a little bit and we're gonna stick it in place here and we're gonna tighten it so it is in place right now on one side 
Now we're going to put it on to the tripod and here is how it looks like. Also put it in place and tighten the screw and there it is. Oh, what is this tag? 25% stop. Not sure what that means. Alright, I have this uh, little battery to test out this light. And here's we're going to connect the power to the battery. And it turns on. And we're gonna put the ends of the power supply to the controller. So that's the controller. And we're gonna connect the controller to the light. And we're gonna twist it nicely to tighten it. Here's a little instruction on uh, how to use it. So on this controller, it has four buttons. The first one is to turn it on. And we have this plus and minus for the button two and three. And on the fourth button it is the mode. It will switch between warm and cool color and the brightness adjustment. So here you can see it kind of it is kind of changing color and the brightness. Very nice. So here I put myself next to the light. And this is how it looks like when I have it on my face. So right now the color has changed to more warm. And I changed the mode to uh, lower the brightness. And I changed the mode again to green. And right now it is changing color to cool white. Change it back to brightness. And here the light is pretty strong, very nice. Alright, let's test it on a uh, real scenario. So the light pointing at me is kind of too warm. So I change, I lower the brightness, I turn off the warm color ceiling light. And here is uh, some more adjusting that I'm doing. It looks pretty good, but I have an idea. Also, I turn off even more ceiling lights here. And right now it is completely dark. So the room is so bright like that. Here's a little backdrop color that I added in. Apparently my phone camera lens wasn't clean, but it looks pretty good there. There is surely a more adjustment to do. Now here is off light and on light. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video. So please